Greetings, this is Bodril and welcome back to Let's Play Stellaris Scope with Majestic. Hello. Alrighty. So, what the hell we were doing? I think we were planning to go upwards and conquer everyone. Everyone, pretty much. So when do you think we should uh, do that? Well, if we declare war on the blue ones, we cannot pass to the red ones. So I think the red ones are a must. Uh, they all are right. allied with the purple guys, the Dark of Lorenz. But the their power is equivalent to mine. So... All right, that's a big uh, alliance, but then we were a big alliance too. Yep. I regret researching the hyperlanes. They fuck up my map so badly. Have you done that? More stuff. Nope, no way I'm doing <laughs> another travel method. Oh my god. So no way I'm making my empire more ugly than it is with the sectors. Seriously though. It's so annoying. Alright, damn, I need to build some more ships. Uh, Alright. We're going to war, we need to prepare. Uh, what do you have? Mm, let's make um Whoa, I'm already building. Okay. I guess Alright, I'm building on both. Well then let's build uh, up a bit, hit our uh, ceiling, naval power wise. Or naval capacity wise, and then uh, we'll go attack the red ones. Yep, we also have my symbol. Yeah. Those deserters. I should probably build a, a good uh, spaceport uh, up top to one of the systems so we can uh, repair there and uh, do stuff like that. Mm -hmm. Yep, makes sense. Refuel, etc. Uh, upgrade fleets. Result. Because otherwise we'll have to journey all the way back here. Alright, let's see. Shit, I have no spaceports. On the new ones. Or yeah, I have I mean it... but they are not level 6. Yeah. That's what I'm doing now. Mine was one. It's time to upgrade it. They made peace or oh, they were fighting someone else. Also, they probably hit us uh, high. I think we are pretty safe. Uh, at least I'm pretty safe. We are covered by everyone. <laughs> yeah, we should make some uh, decent uh, defenses over here. Uh, armies. They have some huge guys. Nope, not here. Let's make some psionic ones, I guess. Wow, psionics. Hmm. Hmm. This guys are out. But everyone jumping in? No, 
because if they don't go use warp, they won't go to the hmm, the game. Yeah. Shit. We we'll probably need some uh, attacking armies as well. Oh, all the Sai armies are attacking. Okay. Nice. Oh, colony established. Forgot that I. Hmm. Had that planet. We should do prime. Next. <laughs> Alright. The normal. Uh, Alright, let's see. This gives me. Why the fuck do I have advanced bombardment? Stop it! Precognitive interface. Turns hit 4. Parade 8. Weapon damage plus 8%. Weapon rates plus 15%. Turns to evade 10%. Plus 10. Speed plus 15%. Hmm. Oh, really? God damn it. Sacrifice some speed. And sad. Weapon down must get more range, more fire rate. Yeah, okay. Sounds good, actually. Why the hell? That's weird. Oh, that's way. Research complete. It's complete. When someone died. God damn it. Uh. Mm. I guess whatever. I don't want the same thing, AI. Leave me alone. I don't care if it's helpful. I'm not getting that. Yeah, I don't think it's helpful in the long run once they just start to take it. Alright, I'm putting psionics at everything. And we'll see how it goes. All right. Uh, you upgrade and you upgrade. Cool. Do you see the blue rings? Uh, actually, no. Mm, around the stations, you mean? Yeah, around the stations, around the planets. I come in uh, where my uh, capital is. Epsilon system. There are one, two, three, four, five, for some reason. I have one, two, three planets. stations. Yeah. My planets don't have that. Hmm. Could you put something in your ships? Something like a shield regenerator, dampener field? Uh, yeah, I have in the phalanx, I think. Uh, let me see. Maybe that's one of them. Or two of them. Yeah, I have the shield dampener. Shield hit points minus 25%. Uh, percent. Three, one, two, three. You have two defense platforms. So that's yeah. two circles. You have one fortress. 
that's one. And the rest are centered on your fleets. For some you think? Time. Maybe. We'll see when I move it, move I guess. Yeah. Uh, I'm having it upgrade, so. Yeah, it's upgrading. Alright, we need to build some more fortresses. Uh, cover the other planets as well. I hear fortresses. Oh, because in Olium I have uh, Olium Prime covered, but uh, Secundus is uh, not covered at all. I should also build some more monsters or titans, whatever they're called. Uh, monsters, how dare you? <laughs> uh, what are these guys? Ithor Prime. Uh, I don't even have anything here. That's not good. Uh, Hmm. Why can't I build them? I don't know. That's weird. Aha. Due to the rarity of suitable subjects, we will be only able to field a limited number of these armies. Okay. That makes sense. Ships upgraded. Construction complete. All right, let's see. Yep. Moves with me. I guess the different phalanx ships that uh, have that. That's weird. All right. Um, let me see. Uh... 10 and 10, 20 corvettes, 19 destroyers, 15 cruisers. So let's build 5 cruisers. Uh, you know, if I actually had any. Oh my god. Do you want me to <laughs> I just need to do a better work at that. I'm now getting more money than I get the uh, minerals, I should uh, switch one of my sectors to minerals, I guess. My god, my ship maintenance is minus 350 minerals. Yours must be like 600. Alright, my ship... Uh, maintenance... It's 398. It's not that bad. On the minerals? No, on the money. On the money is 281. On the, on the minerals? It's way higher. 288. <laughs> not 288. <laughs> 488. <laughs> Dude. <laughs> YouTube, I was gonna say, but. Yeah, it's YouTube. close enough. <laughs> What? Uh, did you finish? You did finish. Okay. Gonna pain me. Back. Okay. Let's search. Clone army to maybe unlock something. Ships upgraded. Hmm, did I 
I think I researched dark matter, I just don't have any. Yeah, you also researched it and you can find nothing on any system. That's not great. I think it should be rare because it gives you a huge boost. But is it rare or non existent? I don't know. Alright, I think I'll bring my. Uh, transport ships. To. Olum. It's below. Oh, yeah. Yeah. That's just in front of me, of course. Cool. All right, let's see. Jesus, I have level 4 uh, minerals and I still don't get enough. Why the fuck? I guess we spend a lot on uh, maintenance. Yeah, especially if you have a huge fleet that you and yeah. I'm getting less money because I'm building fortresses as well. Yep. What can you do? We'll get more uh, sectors which will give us more money to have uh, bigger fleets. It's a problem when you are an expanding empire. Funnily enough, that's the main premise of um, the Honor Huntington books. That. Uh, the Manticora Empire is stable and has like uh, four planets in a solar system or something. But the problem is they are too rich and there is a constantly expanding uh, uh, empire that just can't sustain itself un unless it's at war, basically. <laughs> that is not optimal. Yeah. It is not optimal at all. But uh, when you have a huge empire, it's the only way to sustain it, basically. Especially since that uh, specific empire is uh, idiotic. But yeah. It's really nice, uh, politically, the books. The books are basically space porn. Uh, the, there are huge fights and uh, it's all about missiles and uh, lasers and TCM and TCM, etc. But it's also politics porn on how different uh, kind of governments work or at least possible space governments I don't know it's really interesting Pretty cool. is it better than the miles Volkswagen one it's totally different than the Malcolm can parts uh -huh. nice. I thought it was very for some reason no, Vorkoskian is more, uh, I don't know, how it dressed in space. And by that I mean it's fo it focuses on uh, Miles basically after the first two books. And he's, can he's, he can captain a fleet, but we don't actually see them fight with it. And he's more, you know, on planets and stuff like that. There is that in uh, Honor Harrington, but there is just. It's space opera, it's huge space fights and uh, a lot of intrigue. Nice. It's pretty good. But yeah, Miles is a genius. Yeah.
No arguments there. But I found out I really like military sci-fi for some reason. So basically, Harrington is my favorite series just because 